create double knit, you're going to work with two rails because you're going to be working across the center between the two rails. A double stitch requires two pegs, the front one and the back one. So the weaving for double knit is across both rows, so you're actually interlocking that knitting. Now the resulting knit will be a two-sided fabric, both sides are the same, there is no back side. When you're going to change your color, you're going to just tie it on in between and your tails will just lay in between, kind of hidden in the knit. No blocking is required because it doesn't curl on the edges. So in double knit you can create a very thick fabric or a nice open weave fabric. Now when you're single knitting, by contrast, you're going to use just one rail or a circular loom. The weaving is simply going around each peg adjacent to each other. So you just need to go down the row, around your circular loom, or down the loom and then going back. Now the resulting fabric with that is going to be a little lighter weight. It will tend to curl on the edges, but that can be easily overcome simply with lightly blocking the knit or simply changing the stitch pattern on the edges with maybe some purl stitches.